Hello there, wonderful singers, and welcome to your Kovo Vocal Exercise of the Week. I'm Dr. Julia Nielsen, the founder of Kovo, short for Community Vocalizing, where our mission is to advance singers' vocal health, fitness, and longevity by providing creative vocal exercise routines. And this month at Kovo, the theme for our twice weekly general vocal exercise routines is intervals, chords, and scales. Now, during last week's video, I challenged you to break out of a rut that many of us are stuck in, that is singing only major scales and exercises that are only in major keys. So, to spice things up, last week we learned a whole tone scale exercise. This scale, of course, is just what it sounds like, a scale made up of only consecutive whole steps, that is whole tones. So today I have another scale challenge for you, this time based on the chromatic scale. A chromatic scale is one that's made up of only consecutive half steps. Now I find that this is the most difficult scale for most singers to master. So difficult, in fact, that most singers never even try. The half steps can easily become a little too big or a little too small. The singer can lose count of how many half steps there are supposed to be in getting from one pitch to another. And then they will kind of cheat at the end and either jump down to the tonic, that was a whole step, or sing the last note twice. So the basic chromatic scale, that's tough enough, but I am going to do you one better with our vocal exercise of the week, which I call inchworm. Now, fair warning, this is a very advanced exercise, much more advanced than the exercises I usually share on this channel. But during our live workouts this month, singers have been incredibly enthusiastic about the ear training challenges that I am offering them, like this one, so I'm just gonna go with it. In this exercise, we first alternate ascending whole steps and descending half steps. So we go up a whole step, down a half step, up a whole step, down a half step, up a whole step, down a half step, and that's what the W and H represent on this uh, uh, score. So I think it's fun to use the word inchworm while I sing this exercise because that's what the melody line reminds me of and it also helps me keep my place. So let's try singing this really slowly. Breathe whenever you need to. Here's your starting note. fun yet? Let's try it one more time from the bottom. Inchworm, 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 inch. But that's not all. There is a backside to this exercise. On the way down, everything is reversed. We alternate a descending whole step and an ascending half step. So down a whole step, up a half step, down a whole step, up a half step, down a whole step, etc. Let's try this one nice and slow. We start here. Where 
we started. Let's try that one more time, nice and slow. Here we go. Let's try singing the two halves back to back. You will have a moment to breathe in the middle as I change the slide. So here is our ascent. Here we go. Shall we try that one more time together a little faster? Here we go. to put you to the test if you dare why don't you try singing the ascent a cappella, meaning no accompaniment and I won't sing with you but I will cheerlead or sort of conduct here's your first note here you go and note maybe you did maybe you didn't try the descent a cappella here you go and so I hope that this exercise piqued your interest if this felt really challenging, it probably did, see if you can practice just a basic chromatic scale first. That's a chromatic scale of a third, but if inchworm felt within reach, try mastering it a cappella this week. And while you practice, you will also be giving your middle voice or your lower middle voice some great exercise. Chromatic scales are particularly useful for sopranos and altos in smoothing out what is sometimes called the lower passaggio or that lower break area right here where we've been singing between C and G. If you have enjoyed this exercise, we've got more for you. During June, all of our general 30 minute vocal workouts will be devoted to intervals, chords, and scales. We'll be singing exercises based not just on whole tone and chromatic scales, but on the three types of minor scales, the two types of pentatonic scales, blues scales, and on several modes as well. If you are not already joining these twice weekly live general vocal workouts, we would love to have you. They are absolutely free. We meet on Zoom every Monday and Wednesday from 6 to 6.30 p.m. Pacific time, and instructions on how to request our free Zoom link are in the description below. If you would like the next vocal exercise of the week to show up in your email inbox, you can find out how in the description below. And singers, remember, regular vocal exercise is crucial for your vocal health, fitness, and longevity. Every time you show up at Kovo, you're going to get a creative vocal workout, expert coaching, and a community of friends to practice with. We'll see you there.